we now have a guy who's won the Turkish national championship four times in a row. I'm happy if I can get to work four days in a row on time. He wins the Turkish national championship four years in a row. It's Kantirya Kyoglu from Turkey, of course. Congratulations. Thank you. And um, now this must feel very familiar for you. You're like, oh yeah, well, I'm back to Berlin. I'm, I'm national championship again. Uh, what's different this year? This year, I think I prepared, but like my player, like my plays improved, and like I trust myself so much. Like not so much, but I trust myself. So my self confidence has grown up, and like yeah, okay. I feel better. Right. So so you have a lot more. Um, Like you, you feel like your your level of play is so much higher than before, and your level of confidence mostly. Yeah, most likely. Okay, okay. I remember that when we were in Berlin the last time, we had these little flags on the table for all the national champions, and then at the start of the tournament, the guys with the flags were at the top of the field, of course, and then over the course of the day, all the national champions started to drop out of the tournament. They didn't do so well. Um, I don't remember what it was like for you, but um, why do you think somebody is doing so well at the national level and then at the European Championship they suddenly don't have what it takes? Uh, like, for the national, he prepared, he she prepared so much better than preparing European, and like his energy and motivation gets lower right, for European. Yeah, mm -hmm. like me, and like I do this all time. Like I prepare for national like five months maybe maybe six months like i every day and i couldn't study like i couldn't study to my school exams for studying national so and for european championship i didn't get that motivation mm -hmm. and like i couldn't go up right right okay what's different this year how, how did you prepare this year this year actually it's the same <laughs> okay <laughs> But okay, we didn't talk about this before, right? This is uh, it's not a loaded question. All right, um, do you know what you're going to play this weekend? I actually didn't still decide, but I'm still thinking. Okay, okay. What's um, in the close range? What are the decks that you're looking at at the moment? I'm looking Trickstar, Sky Striker, because like it's just like burn, burn, finish. Okay, that's the usual suspects. Yeah. Okay. All right, all right, all right. So. Um, After you won the, the Turkish National Championship for the first time, um, I, I would think, obviously I don't know, but I would think this is like the, the peak of accomplishments. How do you motivate yourself to win for a second time or even a third or even a fourth time? For my second national, I try to like define my title. Like I motivate myself a lot because like my family and my friends motivated me so much and like for second time I won and like for third time I grind harder than second time and for the fourth time like I said I have to win this have to right um, do you have a, a special process do you test together with your friends or is it just like lo you theory crafting thinking about deck ideas What, what's it look like like I tested for Like I tested on the internet and like just one friend because like I didn't want to show my deck to other people because Turkish community is not like so big but not so small but like I just test one friend. Right. And um, you're obviously the expert. If we're gonna run a tournament in Turkey, where should we go? What's the right place? The awesome place is I think Istanbul. Istanbul? Okay, this is where all the, the magic happens, all the party happens. All right, what, what's the best part about Istanbul? I think the best part is Bosporus and like the uh, the museums and Istanbul is a lot cheaper because now the euro a lot higher like right. if you yeah so okay. cheap. A great great destination you have some culture there you have some very modern elements as well very nice city and if we ever get to be in Istanbul Khan is going to show us around right yes. <laughs> Thank you so much yeah.